In this video series, we're going to be learning how to uh, program in uh, Objective C, and uh, this is a, uh, the introductory video, so there is not much to learn here, as you can see from the screen. Um, uh, first of all, you have to figure out the reason why you want to learn Objective C, and uh, there are only two reasons why you may want to program in Objective C, and the first of those reasons is the fact that uh, you want to uh, develop a desktop application for the Mac OS X uh, operating system. Uh, so, because uh, now that the Apple has uh, established the Mac App Store, it is very easy now to get your um, uh, application right in front of the whole world. I mean, back in the days when uh, the when there were not uh, any uh, Mac App Stores, that means whenever you develop an application, then you have to be hoping that someone is going to find you. So, but everything is different now, and uh, I think it's a, also a very good uh, platform for you to uh, make some money or just uh, to get some fame. So, depending on what you're looking for, and um, uh, also you can uh, learn objective c to develop for to develop an app for the ios platform which is for the iphone and the ipad and this is actually why most people are learning the objective c now because the iphone and the ipad apps are just going going crazy uh, i am not sure i think apple said they have about 750,000 apps right now which is crazy if you, if you think if you think um, about it so anyway so these are the two reasons if you've uh, ever programmed in uh, Java before in uh, any language that is similar object oriented uh, programs such as C++, C Sharp or Java then most of the Objective C codes will be very familiar to you but not all of them but um, at least some of the basic ones will be very familiar to you because um, um, well they're very similar so but uh, if you haven't don't worry everything is going to be start from scratch and you don't have to um, worry too much. So what are the requirements for learning Objective C? Well, you will need a Mac, um, not necessarily, but if you want to, um, if you want a very simple, very easy, uh, you don't want to do a lot of configuration, then it will be best to actually develop on the Mac OS X system, which is an Intel based one. You can use in Windows. There are some uh, other third parties that allow you to actually program Objective C in Windows. I'm not going to be covering any of those because um, I believe uh, strongly that you should be using Mac if you want to, uh, you know, be developing for, for the Apple uh, operating system. And another thing you will need, which we're going to be downloading in the next video, is the Xcode development tool. Uh, Xcode is basically like uh, the Visual Studio for developing on the Windows. So it is the IDE, the Integrated Development Environment, which makes every it makes your life easy. You use it to write codes, you use it to debug your codes, you use it to um, to catch errors and compile everything. So it's like all in one. You 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 even have the iPhone simulator. You have the um, the user face designer so you have everything all in one rather than jumping from one tool to the next tool so everything is in one place so it is the integrated development environment so we're going to download this one in the next video and the third thing you will need is actually your time and commitment because uh, if you want to be uh, a good programmer you have to um, be committed to it you need a lot of time and you have to um, the, the the most important thing that you have to do is actually typing out the codes yourself because uh, most people what they tend to do is just um, knows the theory so basically when I teach you something you understand it you say yeah I know how to do that or oh, yeah I've learned that but you haven't actually typed it out you haven't actually tried it which means even though you understood it but you will not be able to reproduce it next time because you will forget easily even though you think you know it so for you to be good you have to type in other codes and don't get um, discouraged uh, thinking that uh, maybe you're not going to catch up because I'm going to make everything very basic so there's nothing to worry about it's going to be very easy so I'm not uh, I talk too much so uh, let's get down to it and I'll see you in the next video thank you